Hi everyone, welcome to Advice to Think Twice. This is Monica and I'm doing our next 10 days of readings. This will be for Libra, Libra Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. As always, keep in mind the readings are general. Take what resonates as it resonates with you. Disregard the rest. Don't force anything to fit. If you have significant Pisces placements, I have a second channel that you can check out. Linked in the description box below. And as always, thank you in advance for liking, sharing, commenting, for subscribing if you haven't. And thank you so much if you have. So let's see what's going on for Libra. Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs in the next 7 to 10 days from whenever you're watching the video. What's going on for Libra in the next 7 to 10 days? Eight of Cups, Two of Wands, The World, Seven of Pentacles, Two of Cups in the Past, Five of Cups. You might be dealing with the Gemini for some of you. They had a bunch of these cards, most of these cards. Six of Pentacles, the Chariot, the King of Swords, their pentacles, I swear to God, they, they they had almost every single card apart from the Two of Cups. Yeah, and the Eight of Cups. Bottom of the deck, Temperance. Okay. Libra, for you, what I'm seeing is the potential for a reconciliation, if that's what you want. It just depends on the situation. It depends how long it's been since the departure because someone walked away from this in the past you have the two of cups so something that was mutual it was just getting started it was just getting you know off the ground um for some of you it could have been a friendship and you tried to date and it didn't go well so you know you, you can go back to the friendship um or a co-worker situation and now it's just awkward um but for others of you it's something that didn't quite get off the ground someone left someone detached and left if you're dealing with the water sign they left cancer scorpio pisces for some of you it's because i'm not seeing betrayal animosity it's because they moved away some of you for some of you they took a job and they moved away or this could be new i'm reading it as i'm seeing it but you apply it as it makes sense to your situation if it does um for some of you someone took a job and they had to move and you couldn't do long distance it wasn't working for others of you this is someone went away for studies this is someone went away to look after family for a while and it just you couldn't make it work long distance so you just had to release it okay but um i feel like you were always left waiting for them and they were always left waiting for you waiting for a better time we're waiting for a time hoping you can bring this back around it's almost like let's see what happens there's nothing we can do now, but hopefully with the passing of time, this, this we can do something. I don't know, okay? So crowning you, we have the world definitely dealing with someone or something that's at a distance. If you had to walk away from something, could it, be, it could be a dream job, a dream situation. You just have to walk away you know, for other responsibilities because of other responsibilities or whatever the case may be. Uh, the world card crowning is definitely dealing with something or someone that's at a physical distance. And that's what's on the mind a lot. Travel is on the mind a lot. Relocation is on the mind, mind a lot. Bringing something back around is on the mind a lot. The challenge is there's distance. And the challenge is we've already had one opportunity at this. We've, only, we've already had one shot at this. It didn't work. And in order to try it again, we can't be apart. We have to be in the same place. That's what I'm seeing here, okay? So in the near future here we have the five of cups and when you have the five of cups with the two of cups in a reading it it could definitely be talking about come back around energy reconciliation energy because that's the two of cups behind her okay especially if it's a situation where you never quite moved on they never quite moved on so there could be initial contact there could be because i'm also drawn to the bridge behind her someone could be traveling unexpectedly showing up at your, your door Especially if it's traveling over water or overseas involved. For some of you, this is very specific. But for some of you, someone had to go to jail. Or someone had to be, to go to rehab or to, to be institutionalized in some way. So there was nothing you could do about it. Well, that's sad. 
In high to yourself, we have the Six of Pentacles. Your interest for this is still very much there. Their interest for this is still very much there. The situation is still mutually wanted and desired, okay? In your environment, we have the Chariot. This is the victorious arrival. I feel like someone's testing the waters, and if you say yes, they're, they're literally going to move to where you are. They don't care at this point, okay? Or this could be you, the Chariot energy. If they have a shot, if you give them a shot, they will give it their best, right? They're not going to hold back. They will move if they have to. They will do whatever it takes with the chariot. That's that energy. Because they feel incredibly guilty for whatever it is that they did, especially if it's them here, okay, that they left. They feel incredibly guilty, remorseful, and they want to make it right. That's the only thing they've been thinking about since they left. As soon as they left, they knew it was wrong. As soon as they left, they knew they'd made the wrong decision. I do hear that. They'll tell you that. King of Swords in your hopes and fears, Libra. So hopefully, you're hoping you're going to make the right decision. The fear is, I hope, um, I'm being told the truth. There's also a fear that you might be too, that you might be closed off that you might not want to hear them out, that you're not going to give them a chance. For some of you, I feel like that's a fear for you as well. It's like, I don't know how I'm going to react until they're in front of me. Because emotionally, you're still very much hurt. But it's almost like you had to shut down your emotions for this person or this situation because you were given no other choice. And only com completely be uh, rational and reasonable here, logical, I can't get my words out. Um, so it's almost like if I have to if I have to tap into tap back into my emotions for this person or the situation, I'm gonna go right back to where I got hurt because that's where I still am emotionally. Okay. Crown uh, crowning in the I can't talk in the outcome though the Knight of Pentacles. I do feel like you're gonna give them an opportunity to prove themselves. This is putting together a plan. This is putting together goals and objectives and time frames and, you know, being very practical about it. And moving very, very slowly. But I do feel like, especially with the temperance card here, this is meeting in the middle, giving someone a chance, integrating, coming together, coming back together, okay? Interesting, Libra. Let's clarify the Five of Cups. Yeah, look, you have the Lovers. The Wheel of Fortune and the King of Wands. Fire, Sun, Energy, Aries, Leo, Sag for some of you. Knight of Pentacles in the outcome. Queen of Swords. Eight of Pentacles and the King of Cups. You're going to make them prove, for, prove themselves, work for it. The Knight of Wands under the Temperance. Listen, I'm telling you, you're dealing with something or someone that's at a distance. They've been at a distance from you physically. Uh, it could just be emotionally or no contact, no communication. But I feel like for a lot of you, this is physical distance that has separated you um yeah someone just left but they were they never got over you the lovers and the wheel of fortune fire sign energy here they never got over you the attraction is still there the the chemistry is still there the passion is still there the mutual interest is still there if it's about a job it's like they couldn't find anyone better than you this is a situation where you could have gone to your company and said listen I have to go be closer to my family family for a while. Could you transfer me to this city? I don't want to leave the company, but could I have a transfer to this city or could I be could I work from home for a while so I can work remotely? You know? And they said no. And so you said, Well, that leaves me no choice. I quit. Right? But it's like you were made for that job and they never were able to find anyone even close to you, let alone to do the job better than you. So now they're going to be reaching out to you saying, hey, Libra, what's your situation? We really want you back. Can we talk about this? If you need to work remotely, we can work something out. If you need to, you know, if you want us to officially transfer you, we can work something out. But it's definitely coming back around energy here. Okay. And then with the Knight of Pentacles. Yeah. Look, Queen of Swords this is your energy. You're like, I'll, I'll hear you out. I'll hear what you have to say. However, you say one wrong thing, or you try to lie to me, or you, you know what I mean? One, you put one toe out of line, and I'll cut it off, okay? This is giving someone the opportunity to prove themselves, to work to earn your trust again, to work to earn your um, appreciation, your love, your interest again, 
We have water sign energy here, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. For some of you, you could be dealing with two people. If you, if this is, if you're current in your presence, you have a fire sign, and this whole thing happened with the water sign. The water sign's coming back, and that's going to present you with a choice with the lovers, a big choice. Do you go back to the person from the past, where for whatever reason you couldn't maintain it over distance? Or do you continue on the current path you're on with this other person? I feel like for the most part, your heart is with the person from the past or the situation, the job, the, whatever this is from the past that never could get a, a proper chance, okay? But, um, yeah, you'll, you'll have to figure out what you want to do here. Like I say, for the most part, I feel like your heart is is with the, the past situation because it's almost like you want to see what could happen if you gave it a proper chance you want to see what could happen where it could go you know that's what I'm seeing here and I feel like for a lot of you that's what you're gonna do but you're gonna have a plan you're gonna have you're gonna tell them all about your expectations and you're gonna tell them what you expect to see by what time but I genuinely see someone who all they need is a chance if you give them a chance it's like they got nothing. They, they're not going to hold back at all. They'll put you first because they made that mistake again. They're not going to make that mistake again. Sorry. They'll put you first. They'll show you what you mean to them. This is someone determined to prove themselves to you. So I feel like for the most part, this is course correct and you're revisiting and reinvesting in something from your past. Again, this is not something that was bad, negative, toxic abusive none of that this is something where it was like sophie's choice okay it was an impossible choice that this person had to make and at the time even though the connection was really strong they had to make a rational decision and be like i've only just met this person i've only just met libra on this other hand my job is sending me over there i can't quit my job for this new person even though i feel the connection what if i'm crazy what if i'm making it up you know, I can't quit my job for someone I've been on a couple of dates with. Or I can't turn away from my family for someone I just met. I have to be, I have to be realistic, okay? Um, I feel like, yeah, they, it was, there was no, they felt like there was no right choice in that situation and they had to put, their responsibility first they had to put you know their ability to be a provider first they had to put their family first and they walked away as soon as they walked away they knew they made the wrong choice but by then it was too late okay so Libra interesting story a bit of a telenovela in, in a way um, but also can be a really beautiful story you know to tell the grandkids I don't know. You tell me. You tell me how you resonate with the reading if you do. In, in what way. And remember, this can be about a person and romance, yes. But it can also be about a dream you had to walk away from. And now you can go pick it back up. All of this could just be you. Not involving anyone else. You know, and now you can revisit that what it is that you absolutely love. That you chose to set aside. And you knew it was the wrong choice to do at the time, but you had to just do what you had to do. And now this is you going back to something that you love. And it's like, I'm going to make this a priority. I'm going to give this my best shot. I have to, right? So that's how it could be playing out for you. Again, I'm reading the energies and I'm giving you examples. But if it rings bells for you in other ways other than the ones I'm describing, take the messages as they make sense to you, okay? So I'm going to leave it there. Watch your other placements. Take care of yourself. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.